Hello, I'm Lucas Haddock and I'm here today at the Hitachi Connected Technology Dig Day, here with Mark, who's going to talk me through some of the features of this connected machine. Hi, I'm Mark, Hancon UK, um, and I'm just going to give Lucas a brief introduction to how to operate the tilt rotator on this machine. So Mark, I'm interested in operating this machine. What are a few things I should know before I get in? Okay, so what you've got to remember now is you've got a tilt rotator fitted to the machine. So it's going to behave slightly different to how it would if it just had a standard digging bucket on. You've also got to be mindful that you've got a little bit of extra length on the end of the arm of the machine. So the controls of the machine will remain the same as they are on any other excavator, but you've got a lot more going on on the joysticks because you've got to control the tilt, rotate, extra one and extra two functions. So the standard setup is you've got a roller on the front of each joystick. Your right one does tilt, your left one does rotate, and then the rollers on the back, the one on the right hand side would do your gripper and the one on the left hand side back would do anything that's connected hydraulically underneath the tilt rotator. So Mark, what is it I should know about the tilt rotators? What makes them so good in a building site? Well basically it turns the machine into a tool carrier. You can perform lots of different tasks you wouldn't necessarily be able to do with a standard equipped machine. You can offset dig and you can perform like I say, you can perform a lot of tasks that, that simply just aren't unachievable with a standard machine. All right, Mark, should we get started then? Yeah. All right, so now I'm ready to give it a go in this machine. Hello, it's Lucas again here, back with Andrew. I've just had a go on this machine over here with the Encon tilt rotator on it. And Andrew's here to tell me more about it. Yeah, so obviously we're here today in Whitchurch at the Leica Training School. We're hosting a dig day with our colleagues from Itachi Construction and obviously the guys from Leica Geosystems. So yeah, basically what we've done here today is given our end customers a chance to come together and see all these bits of technology working together. The guys at Hitachi Connected Technology obviously have organised this. We're here to support them and obviously show off some of our products and what we can do. So with Hitachi Connected Technology, what does that mean for you at Encon? So basically Hitachi Connected Technology is a sort of division, if you like, of Hitachi Construction Machinery UK. Their job is to sort of handle the sort of specialist attachments, you know, tilt retainers, machine guidance and things like that. Obviously that means then when people order these things through Hitachi, they fit them themselves, they support them themselves, all from their facility up at uh, Port of Tyne. So with your tilt rotator, I've heard something about the hitch, something special about it. Could you please yeah, tell so, me more? Yeah, uh, so what we have is what we call QSC. So this is something that we offer as standard, uh, well, Itachi offers standard on all their Encon tilt rotators. So when you buy what we call a twin hitch setup, so that means you have a, a machine coupler on top and obviously a, a, a coupler underneath the tilt rotator. With that then you get our hitch controller. So with that, what it means is you have to have ground pressure in order to release attachments. So that's a really big added safety feature for our end customers and contractors on sites. It just reduces the risk of dropped attachments and buckets, uh, which obviously increases the safety on site. So along with the safety, how do the Encon tilt rotators and the Leica systems fit in mm -hmm. together in the machine? Well. I think uh, the, the sort of general trajectory of plant at the moment is improved efficiency with obviously the massive increases in fuel the last year, the, you know, the removal of the red diesel uh, for construction. Obviously anything where you can squeeze that saving out of every job, whether it be on the fuel, getting the job done quicker, more efficiently. The other thing obviously is the, there are obviously less uh, sort of traditional operators around nowadays. So this, extra technology gives those younger operators the chance to work to that same standard, you know, that level of precision that the, the old school operators used to. So speaking more about how they get rid of red diesel, what are your opinions on that? Well, I don't, I don't necessarily have an opinion on it. I mean, ultimately it's a government thing, but obviously it does make, make it more difficult and the cost of operation more expensive for our customers. Obviously, part of what we offer is reduced fuel because one of the things about the tilt rotator is obviously the reduction in movement on site. 
so then you're, you're burning less diesel, you're getting jobs done quicker. Obviously, less, you know, with things like our ECR, which is our automatic quick coupling system, you can change attachments very quickly. When it's integrated then with the Leica, uh, so what we offer is what we call EPS, it's our NCOM positioning system. What that does, it, it, it tells the dig system the rotation position of our tilt rotator, so then obviously through the plan that, that's obviously been laid out, you know, you can work more efficiently and to a more precise level. We also have things like automatics available with Leica, so you can have automatic control of things like your tilt functions, so you just work in even more precisely, you get the job done quicker. So, uh, how many different rotators and tilt rotators are on the market at the so, minute for you at Encore? So we have everything going from, we offer models from one and a half tonnes all the way up to 33 tonnes, so that means that you can have it on anything from a, a small mini digger up to a 30 odd tonne machine. So yeah, it's a lot of opportunities there for you to increase your efficiency, safety and productivity on site. I saw a marking on the side of the tilt rotator EC oil. Would you like to tell me yeah, about absolutely. that? So EC oil, as I said, is our quick coupling system. So what that does, it automatically connects up your hydraulics, your electrics, and you can also have central lubrication so that if you have an auto grease system on the machine, that can all be run through the EC oil. The other good thing then obviously is if you're using the dig system, you can obviously have the Leica, so that can run through it. So let's say for example, you've got a tilt rotator with Leica on, you can obviously run it with and without the tilt rotator. So when you're not using the tilt rotator and you disconnect that, the dig system then disconnects with it from the tilt rotator and then obviously you've got separate measurements for, you know, if you're using bucket, your buckets on the, the top hitch or the bottom. But that all connects up automatically through the electrics on the EC oil. So, so with the viewers watching, how long would an Encon system last on the machine? Uh, I mean, it's a little bit of a variable, obviously depending on the type of work you do and how well you look after it. But we have customers, for example, on the rail sector where maybe it's sort of lighter use that are running 20 year old, 15 year old units. In construction, maybe this type of work, you'd be maybe looking sort of six, eight years, but you can obviously change it over and refurbish, repair, and you know, as long as the maintenance is good on the unit, it'll, it'll last several machines. Thank you, Andrew, for this. Thanks for letting me come here, and it was nice to meet you. Yes, thank you, Lucas. Appreciate it.